Ed. New tonight, the search is on for two missing teenagers. Their parents say the two left high school nearly a week ago. Team 12's Michael Doudna has the very latest on the search. Guys, it's been nearly a week since the last confirmed sightings of Mason Palmer and Eliza Jones here at Campo Verde High School. Since then, it's been a week of stress and searching for two families that just want their kids to come home. Just the best kid. She's my baby. She's my only child, and I just want her here. Mason Palmer and Eliza Jones come from loving families. More than I can ex explain. Both with big dreams, the two Campo Verde students began dating last month. Typical teenage first love. Seemed like a typical relationship. But last Friday, friends say the two told them they were going to run off to Flagstaff or California because they couldn't spend enough time together. That afternoon, they would last be seen by school cameras and a friend's photo walking off campus. It's me feel like I can reach him through those photos and be like, Mason, we love you, we miss you, like get your butt home. Things, but now, you know, the reality hits and it's, and it's hard. Since that point, the week has been one of searching, chasing every lead. Well, you have to act on everything. We have to, I hear that they're at Einstein's, I'm straight over to Einstein's, I'm looking for cameras, I'm looking for witnesses. But so far, there's been nothing. And both families don't know how far they could go as they don't have access to their phones, a driver's license, or even a bank account. Um, they do, it's not like they have some type of funds because they have to eat, they have to sleep somewhere. So someone's helping them out. Mason's family hired Chris Caterina as a private eye to help with the search. But both families are doing whatever they can to try and find some way, somehow, to get their kids back home. I want to know where you are. I want to know. Just give me a sign that you're okay and I can come find you. Now, if you have seen or, or know the whereabouts of Mason or Eliza, you are asked to please call Gilbert Police or that private investigator. I'm Michael Doudna, 12 News.